Cheers, squadron leader. Chin chin. Morning. Look, it may come as something of a surprise to you, Blaney, but in this pub we sell liquor, we don't give it away. Still less do we expect our employees to steal it. I was going to pay for it. Oh, yeah, I'm sure you were. Yeah, well, that's the last drink you're getting on this house. Go on, get out. I told you I was going to pay for it. I always pay for my drinks. Even for your watered-down gin. Now, don't come the innocent with me, you bastard. My stocks have been well down this past month. Now, you watch what you're saying. What, to a thief? What's going on? Our friend here says that I've been pinching his booze. Ridiculous. He always pays. How would you know? Well, I work with him, don't I? And what else? What's that supposed Look, to mean? Just keep out of this, will you, Babs? Come on, Blaney. Outside, you're fired. You can't do that. He never stole nothing in his life. He puts the money in the till. I've seen Look, him. A thief or a boozer. It's all the same to me. I don't need either one as a barman. Quite apart from the fact, half the time, he's pulling your tits instead of pulling pints. Now, look here. He can't keep his hands off you. The customers are always talking about it. And what about you? Always fingering me? You keep your lying mouth shut, Babs. You can get out as well. I'm off. Keep the chance. I'll send for my things later. Just a minute. There was a little matter of ten pounds I advanced you on your salary. You planning to steal that as well. We know what to do with them. You shouldn't let him talk to you like that. I know. What are you going to do, love? I don't know. Another pub, perhaps. Are you all right? I mean, you just gave him back the ten quid you borrowed. I had to. He didn't think I had it. Don't worry, I've got a bit left. But this is Covent Garden, not the Garden of Love. How about starting work? Oh, get stuffed. Look after yourself. I'll call you. Thanks, girl.